What's popping off? Raj Holland and y'all real quick. Gonna do a quick, quick, quick. Let me uh, let these windows up here. A quick. It, it, this doesn't require me to do a whole bunch of like jibber jabbering at the mouth. It doesn't require me to make a song. It doesn't require me to do anything. Not because it's not a good scent. Not because it's not a good scent. But it's cut and dry. It's about this fat dude. And he's always working on electronics. But I think this dude be smoking weed, yo. Bam, the fat electrician. Semi modern tape on Vetiver. A lot of people, I'm behind the game on uh, Itat La Vre de Onja. I'm behind the box, but that's okay. Eventually I'll catch up. And uh, I've caught up. This is about a dude with the work. Came to my studio, maybe. Told him I need to, you know, got some, put some extra, put some extra outlets, you know what I mean? Put some 110s, give me another circuit breaker in the board to make sure my gear is running top speed with the star ground and all this stuff. Do that. And he was like, all right, I'll be right back. I got all the stuff I need to do this. I'll be right back. So he leaves out and, uh, you know, he comes back. And when he comes back, he looking a little funny. I'm like, why this guy looking like this? You know, he looked like that when he, when he left out. He looked kind of, kind of funny. By the way, these are like sprays number 29 and 30. <laughs> yo, I can't, this is another one I can't get enough of, real talk. Yo, this joint is a banger. All right, so anyway, he comes back. I'm like, yo, man, you been smoking? He's like, nah, man, I don't smoke like that, cuz. I'm like, cuz, I smell weed. Well, that's after he had left for, say, about half hour to like an hour, he came back. When he came back, the boy was smelling like weed. But I'm gonna say, no, I'm not gonna say that. I'm gonna say, he came back after about two hours, two, two and a half hours. I'm like, yo, where you been, cuz? I'm trying to get this done, man. I'm ready to set the studio up. I got a client coming in here in a couple hours. I need to set up, man. They think I'll be up and running. I got to make sure we got that voltage correct and everything. He came back kind of, kind of, you know, happy, but like he was eating. He was eating a lot. He's like, yo, man. He grubbing like his butt. I'm like, yo, you, huh? you that hungry, cuz? I mean, he's fat. He's fat electrician. He eat like that. I'm thinking, okay. The boy fat like that, he eat like that because he's fat, right? The boy smell like weed. The boy smell like weed. Like he been smoking weed. That's all I got to say. After about four, five hours, this smells like weed. I mean, that, look, I ain't smoked weed in 28 years since I've been working for my job, so. Because we had random drug tests, so ain't no weed smoking around here. Ain't losing my job to smoke some weed. That's dumb. Some people do. They can't stop. Once they get the job, they can't stop. Cuz. This smells like weed at the wild. That's all I got for you. I'm out. Yo. Awesome. Vanilla vetiver, man, with a little bit of wood, some old, some old stuff in it, whatever. Yeah, I get it. I might go full bottle on this, but I want to test out a couple more, so I'll probably buy a couple more 30 mils, you know what I mean? Because if you can buy a 30 mil Nassimato, you can buy a 30 mil of this. If you can buy a 30 mil Rose, you can buy a 30 mil of this. So that's what it is. So I'm trying to tell you, don't be ashamed to get the 30 mil. You don't have to have a 100 mil bottle all the time. Even as a collector, you don't, because you collect what you collect. And some things don't want to get in a whole big bottle. Sometimes you want to get a small bottle, and keep your hard-earned cash for a big bottle of something like Roger Doug 1, 2, or 3 for $1,100. Right. Or Tom Ford trying to get over with that boy's Moroccan, Bois Moroccan, for $100 more than what he normally sells for in a 50 and a 100. Yeah, right. I got to go. Got stuff to do. Fat electrician. Dude was smoking weed. But he did a good job on the studio. It's up and running. The electric was good. 
Got 120 coming through there, straight up through all the equipment, and we're good to go. We ain't got no drops. We ain't got no problems. We ain't got no voltage drops or spikes. That's because I have that monster. I got that monster electrical condition unit. You know what I'm saying? So, but still, again, you still want your electric hooked up. Bam! Fat boy smoking weed. He got to go. I'm out. Ride the real D cool. Hope everything's well with you and the family. And uh, you know what we do. You know how we do, all right? Keep that thing up in prayer. And uh, last but not least, what I want to say, www.rajur.net. www.rajur.net. You can find my music. You can find my links. You can find everything you want to find out. Once you click on YouTube, you're going to take it all the YouTube videos. Once you click on SoundCloud, you can check out all the music. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bing. Listen to this dog on Real D Cool CD right there in the background. That's how we do it. And I'm going to go ahead on out and call it a day. I'm out. Six and a half. That's how we do it. We don't need no long reviews anymore. I'm going to get right to the point. And you know it. And then it goes. And then it weaves through the weaver. And then after that, it calms down and melts to a great. And then when, then when you look at it and you're around somebody, uh, Aka Maka Raka made it with 1943. And then you go back. Man, please, will you stop it? I'm not watching all that no more. Right to the point, like Katie Prickett.